Oh, hello there. Here I have a uh, uh, Yumig Mark 502D. That is a silent projector that takes both Super 8 and Single 8. And it's from Austria. And I couldn't find this special brand though uh, online. I could only found, found um, that Mark 610D was made in 1973. And I guess uh, this must have come before that, so this is somewhere before 1973, 1970 maybe, from Austria, yeah. And you can see that, this stands here, made in Austria, with a ni pretty nice logo, logo there, actually. And yeah, and can I open this up, I wonder? Yeah, I can with that, I will do that later then. Um, but there was no power core to this when I got it. And oh yeah, it looks like this on this side. Uh, nothing super special, something special there, no. And you can see this is just a, this uh, normal data cable, data computer <laughs> cable. So I have one of those here. So we'll hook it up. We'll see how it works. I tested it so I know that the lamp is working anyway. Uh, the other one we did it did it not in one take, but we can do this in one take. And let's see here now if uh, it's. Let's see here. Is that stuck? Oh yeah. There. Oh. There we go. Hey, you can see the the, um, the lamp is on. Okay. Anyway, can I? Yeah, I can also pick this out. That I love that you can do. Um, if you get a not a computer that, that another projector that doesn't work, um, that means really good, better than the other one, and it's uh, light over here. So this will probably work better than the other one. So yeah, that's slow motion. And uh, what is what's that? What is that? Let's rewind, okay. What is... Oh. I don't know why it's... it's is that true? Because of rewinding it takes this out? Can, can you, if you look from this side here, when you push on rewind, it releases that from there. That from there. So that's, uh, I don't know why you need to do that, because when you're winding, the movie is going to go up here. When you're winding, so why does it need to lift that up? I don't understand it. So, yeah, you can sit down there again. Uh, and we're going to see here if we can have this, this reddish movie that is uh, laid in trap. Let's see here now. That is... Oh, no. That's not forward. That is forward. So, if we put it in here somewhere, I think. Should be there. Oh, there. Can you see on this end now? Oh, there. Here it comes. I didn't know that was going to happen. I thought it was going to come here from somewhere. Okay, so it come up there. Right, so... There. So. So, now this big wheel here, if you look close at this one, and you can see this is so close to the edge there. But it made this in... in uh, what you say? They made this hole in, in here so this would fit this uh, kind of big reel. That, that's good. And uh, very perfect there. And nice, nice. So we'll try and run this. Let's see what happens. Everything is going nice. And we are on. Is that. What do they mean here? This, there is an S and there's an N. Is N normal? 
and that is super. It's, it should be, I guess, that. So um, we go with that and we see what happens. Because this is super 8. So um, the light, and you can put away that and go forward. And there's redis over there. And let's see here if I can change the focus. I do that over there. Oh, wait, this is a decent move over there. Add it. Oh, almost. Oh, look at that. Uh, that was. Can I. Um, how do I do that? Can I do something here? No. Hmm, I need to. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. I forgot to put this uh, here, up, so that I need to do. But also I need to uh, wonder how you can change the frame. Because that was really, the quality was way better there. So I don't know how to change the frame though. There uh, must be some way to do that. Uh, what happened here now? Um, there. Now we'll put that in there and put that there. So, and this is doing something. But the quality was really better now than before. Um, yeah, let's watch again here. I don't know. It's not, it's in slow motion. There you go. That looks pretty good, only red though. But I need to move the frame down a little bit. And I don't know how to do that. Maybe I can, if you go back here, if you, we can try. Maybe I will, as I did with the other one, I push the movie out from everything. Or maybe there's something over here, no? This should be something. There's a thing here all up here. So I can't do anything. And also this this thing, but this will not do anything. There is nothing else. Uh, let, let's try and just change uh, watch over and see if what happens if change to normal. Oh. Alright, but you can see that the screen is getting a bit smaller than that one. So, but... Yeah, but, but somehow we need to change the... How do we do that? And this one doesn't do anything up here. I don't know what that, that is here. Yeah, I will try and open up, but probably the, the film will go out. And that would be weird if you need to open up here just to change how the film is rolling. Can I, oh. oh, everything is falling apart here. Oh, I didn't, I was, I was just expecting this part to go loose, not all this part. But well, here we are. There's a... Oh, here we have something. Oh no, okay, that's for that one. Huh. Alright. See here, the thing I can do, I can... Pull this a little bit here, maybe. No. That's really weird. There should be something I can do just to change the frame up and down. That shouldn't be so hard. Because overall, this uh, machine works really well.
I don't know how to do that, actually. We can... Oh, this was a stop mechanism on that. Stop, and I push that out. Mm -hmm. uh. Oh, why didn't we want to go now? Oh, there we go. If you see there, that it's really annoying though that I can't put down the the, the frame there. It's a little bit. But overall, the quality is really, really fine. It is almost a bit color, actually. A nice color. Sad we can't hear the sound here now. But it seems like it has been um, reddish. He, he hasn't been so much reddish. The guy there. Anyway. Um, so, um, yeah. Let's see if we can put this back here. So, I must say this was very, very easy to take down though. And very easy to uh, change the lamp I saw and everything. And the hardest thing was how do you change the frame? That's so weird. And why is there a thing there? You can hold on it. That's weird. Well, uh, that's it for that. But I will, we will open this up also, and I can have the film. And maybe I can sh wait. I can do. I can rewind the movie actually. Um, there was a rewind thing. Maybe now we'll see why this opened up a bit. Oh. All right. So you can have super speed when you rewind it, in a way. So that's why it opens this up. So it doesn't hit the... This rewind I really lo like. Nice rewind. Super rewind. Really nice. Can come really in handy. Um, oh, so... Let's open this up here. Maybe you change the frame over here, but I don't think so. There's something I missed. It's probably super easy. You can tell me in the comments if you know. Um, let's see how big the things are inside here. Hopefully I'm not destroying it all now. It will be a big sign in here that says frame changing. <laughs> um, well, maybe you can't change the frame, but that's you should be able to do that. Not like a standard thing. Oh, well, here we have some stuff. Chains. Chains. Now this is this is better than. Uh, rubber things though change I like because those those doesn't break or they can of course I guess but yeah that's a really cool thing in there but no year you cannot some small break you think or something I don't know Nice thing. Nothing I understand though. Uh, except the uh, uh, chain thing there. So. Oh well, that's uh, it for this then. And uh, do tell me how to change the frame, that would be nice. Thank you for that. And uh, take care everybody.